Today I'm sharing exactly how to make this easy green onion dip recipe. It's so delicious. It is ready in about 15 or 20 minutes. You can totally make it ahead the morning of an event and you just need a blender and Nutribullet so you can mix all of the green onion dip together. So I'm gonna show, show you how to make it start to finish and we're gonna do it right now. So the first thing to do is to prep the green onions and the jalapeno. So you're using about five green onions and half of a small jalapeno with the pith and the seeds removed. That's the inside part of the jalapeno. So just cut off the top, slice it in half, cut out that white part in the middle and the seeds and then it will be a little bit less spicy and then you want to go ahead after you trim off the roots and everything from the green onions brush all the vegetables with olive oil and sprinkle them with garlic powder that's all you need to do to add some massive flavor it's going to taste so good so you can make this in a flat cast iron pan on the stove but here I have a grill pan and I also have a really delicious grill pan chicken recipe you should check out if you own a grill pan. So anyways, I'll leave you a link to the grill pan so you can check it out on Amazon if you don't have one. Like I said, just sear them up three to five minutes on each side um, with some olive oil and that garlic powder and then they're ready to get blended up. So once they're cool enough that you can handle them, give them a rough chop, and then prepare the rest of your uh, vegetables or whatever you're using for your vegetable platter. This is a really great green onion dip with Greek yogurt for uh, potato chip dip, or you could be dipping carrots and celery and cucumbers like you see in my video. So just blend all the ingredients together. You're gonna add the grilled onions and jalapeno and then some cilantro some greek yogurt and salt so you don't put all of the greek yogurt in there at once you just blend it together with a part of it and then you add in the rest of the greek yogurt at the end that's going to keep the greek yogurt dip nice and thick it's not a super thick dip some people wonder if you could use like cream cheese when you're making green onion dip or sour cream when you're making green onion dip i'd prefer to use sour cream or greek yogurt like in this recipe because it's not as thick as cream cheese that would just be a little bit too much that could make a good like cream cheese for a bagel though. So anyways, just showing you, we did a little happy hour at home. Thanks so much to Mil Willamette Valley Vineyards for sending over some of their Pinot Noir. And we had this wonderful green onion dip with Greek yogurt and jalapenos. If you're into cooking, check out some of the other recipes I have on Sip Bite Go. And until next time, have a wonderful and delicious day. Cheers.